So I found out that I got the grant for the UCLA extension. I wasn't able to take feature film to like I wanted. So I um, applied for this. I met the filing period and I woke up and they haven't sent me a confirmation that I got it, but they did send me like enrollment information. So I've already been enrolled in the class that I picked and um, I will show you how that works right now. So UCLA has a scholarship for financial, based off of financial needs, and it comes up um, every quarter. So there is a filing period uh, of a specific time that you have to meet. My filing period was, um, the deadline was February 21st. I got it in before the 21st. They give you confirmation. It's all through email. So you fill out an application, you give them some supporting documentation, such as um, the amount of money that you you made, um, so your tax statement. If you are married, you're gonna give that information too to see who um, who else is bringing in money into your uh, your income situation. And do you have dependents, things like that. They take that stuff into consideration. And then they a lot, I think about seven, and I, I may be wrong, I'll have to look at the paperwork. So when you see the paperwork, just read it. Um, but they do a lot, a few, like maybe seven scholarships that cover a portion of the tuition for that specific class. And um, then you may have to give just some information as to, you know, why you do want the scholarship. And um, that usually for me is actually the toughest thing. I've watched a lot of YouTube videos on how to write really well-spoken, well-articulated, um, you know, sentences about why I want a scholarship or why I may need that or qualify for the scholarship. They allow for some additional comments if you've got additional things that you'd like to talk about. They also do ask you a little bit about um, daily or monthly, not daily, but monthly, um, monthly things that you pay for. So utility bills, um, phone bills, cable bills, uh, where excess money may be going to. If you're paying for student loans like I am, I'm still paying for student loans. So it took like about two weeks for me to get a response back about that. It did state that it might take three weeks to actually get a response. So uh, that's pretty good timing, I guess. I don't know if there was just a small amount of applicants or how many applicants there were for this particular semester or this filing period. So keep that in mind that my time um, my time is a little bit different. Um, so I'm really excited to take the next course. This is going to be feature film two with the same instructor. Drop any questions down below and I will see you on the next one, scribes.